Hey guys, it's Melinda here. So today I am filming a haul video and maybe a couple of other videos. I am also attempting to film a day in the life. So um, look out for that. So I guess I will just get started. Big W gave me this massive bag. It's ridiculous. And I got one thing, one thing from Big W and it was $9 and it's just this, sorry, la-di-da um, doll and I got this for Mia for her birthday so it was nine dollars she loves dolls like this so she's gonna have a lot of fun with it I really like getting um, Mia's presents over the course of a year um, so then it's not buying you know everything all at once so next I went to um, Cotton On and these were ten dollars Cotton On Kids and they had, oh, okay, basically I bought stockings for Mia when she was one or two. Um, just of a size small in these and she has outgrown them. Um, I put them on her yesterday and they don't fit her. So I went and got her the size medium. So they're just a really nice like white. They're, I would say that they're kind of cream but they're not. They're like white. Um... They've got this, this little purple at the top and at the toes and they're just gorgeous. So hopefully these ones will fit her. Um, they're only the next size up so hopefully she can still get a bit of wear out of them. To Priceline, I had a um, Priceline voucher of just under $15. So all up this was $20.74 and I ended up paying $6.14. So this was $12.50. This is Matt's um, Oxy face wash, daily face wash. I mentioned this is my empties videos and I'm thinking about getting Matt to do a review if you guys are interested. Maybe the males in your life may be interested in something like this. Um, and then I got... Um, these which were $8.25 so I pretty much just paid for these they were like $6 that's what I ended up paying and these are the Lips Smacker Jellies and I don't know why these appealed to me but they did um, I love lip balm and I just right now I actually went in there to get um, the Nivea lip butter for you know the one in the tin that's what I went in there to get um, but I came out with these went into a bags everywhere then I went into a shoe shop called what is it shoe shop called Payless um, and I just got these slippers they're super cute I went out shopping for Ugg boots with this bottom but like a thicker thicker part of it um, but I couldn't find any anywhere I don't know why nobody sells them I went into Rivers um, because they're having a sale at the moment where they're Ugg boots or shaggies they call them shaggies uh, $15, not $30, and um, they didn't have my size, so that sucks because I really wanted those ones. Um, but I got these, just I can wear them outside or in the house. They're really nice. Well, I wouldn't wear them out, which is what I wanted the other Ugg boots for, so I could actually go out wearing them because dropping me off at school in the morning is kind of cold. And I'm one of these girls that will wear my flip flops or thongs all year round, I just wear them all year round. I don't even have winter pants. I just wear leggings, like three-quarter leggings, and my flip-flops all year round, and I just change out my top. So they're cute. They have little pom-poms and stuff, so they're so soft. I'm really excited to wear them. I'm not too keen about the pattern being brown. They did have pink, but again, they didn't have them in large. Um, I have size 9 to 10 feet, so sucks I mean they didn't even have a lot of smaller sizes either especially at rivers in the in the winter footwear the um, Kmart and I think I spent 50 bucks um, and I just got a couple of things so I got some underwear just black underwear um, then I got um, they're just the cropped leggings. Then I went out of my comfort zone and I actually bought a pair of, what are these called? 
roll down straight pants. Leg is just a straight leg. It's not a a boot leg. It's not a skinny leg. It's just normal. The thing about these though, I love boot leg jeans. Absolutely love them. Or straight leg. Um, you can never find them that are long enough. I want this part here to touch the floor of my foot. Um, so hopefully these ones might bags off until I have tried them on to make sure they do hit my foot because I am quite tall. I'm five foot ten. I'm not the tallest out there, but I'm definitely not the shortest. And I just find a lot of the time the pants are just, just aren't long enough. Same as sleeves on shirts. Like this one, for instance, I knew where around the house, but it stops here. I like my sleeves to come, you know, to here. So I don't know. I'm fussy about that. So, um, yeah, hopefully I don't take them back and they fit really nicely. Um, then I just got some more of these hair like These are the specific ones that I do like to get. Um, so they look like so... Only Kmart has them, I think they're about five bucks, four dollars, five dollars. Um, I actually went in there to look at some elf stuff and I just glanced over at the BYS stuff, which is right next door, and I thought, why am I going to pay double the price, almost double the price, when I can just buy BYS, which is an awesome Australian brand? Um, so this is what the packaging looks like. This is a lip gloss and lipstick duo. Um, it's called Nearly Nude. So this is what it looks like. Let me take this packaging off. The only thing about Kmart's um, stuff now is they don't have any testers, which is kind of a bummer. So this is a lot lighter than I thought it was, but it's still nice. So that's the lipstick and that's the lip gloss. They're really gorgeous. It actually looked a lot darker in the packaging, so I'm kind of bummed about that, but I definitely use it. I really don't have colors that are like this, um, this new color. So that's good. So that is my little haul. I'm sorry if I rambled on a bit. It says nine minutes. Hopefully I can edit it down a little bit. Um, but I am going to film another video and then probably an update or something. Um, let me know if you guys have any video requests in the comments and I'll see you soon. Bye.